progression three, we're going to once again increase the anti-extension emphasis of the hollow hold by extending the legs. Now, the amount you extend the legs will vary person to person as you push them further out away from the body, it will become more challenging. So like with all of them, we always start in one. So we're coming down, ribs connected to the hips, knees float, curl the shoulders, hands press, raise, find that hollow hold two, and then start to extend those knees. If at any point that low back arches off the floor and I can put my hands underneath, that's where we know bring those back in. But if we're all good, we're extended all the way out, embrace that shake, and hold for the prescribed time for our hollow hold progression three. <laughs> 